It's like a tornado of monkey kings. That guy has two pupils per eyeball. Why? We're playing Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. We're looking at the Wild West mod today. This is gonna be a cool mod because it's got custom models as well. Let's look at this cowboy. He's got an actual cowboy hat. We've got like a guy with a regular revolver and a dude with two guns as well. We've got a sniper and we've got cannons, full on cannons and then some kind of Gatling gun as well. Dart, there's just loads of gunfire. Whoa, those cannons are explosive. That is really cool. All right, so the cowboys look like they're just mowing them down. But look at this. This cowboy's taken like an arrow to the arm and he's still going. How tough are these cowboys? I'm just gonna help out this team a little bit. Just some big like long ships just to come through, create a little bit of a distraction. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's see how tough these cow- Whoa! <laughs> that cannon was awesome. Look at that. The ball is like, well, it was, it was stuck in midair. Oh, that's crazy. That is crazy. All right, the long ship's out now. I feel like the cowboys are actually doing a better job than they did last time. And there's more units to fight against. These cowboys are cool, man. I like them. I like them a lot. They've almost won. That's it. It's death. Game over. This like bearded man did it. Good on your bearded man. <laughs> <laughs> we need to ramp up our other army. We really do. The other army is just not good enough. Surely this is going to win. We've got berserkers. We've got archers. We have the king champs at the back there. And then just like a bunch of watches. <laughs> I still don't know if I'm saying that right. Come on. That was the worst camera control ever, Finn. You need to control the camera better than that, dude. But look at all those arrows coming through. That is cool. Yeah. We're gonna dominate them this time because the kings are coming in. Can the kings handle being shot with a shotgun? Whoa! That was cool, man! All right, all right. Yeah, now we're beating them. Now we're beating them. All right, look at this king. He's survived everything. Whoa! <laughs> Except for being pummeled by some arrows. He's still alive, though. And he's chasing down this dude with the gun. Oh, dude just copped an arrow to the face. <laughs> Oh no, the beard can't handle an arrow. All right, let's scrap these guys. And let's go for World War One. You know that's happening in a farm. That's for sure. Let's get like all of them. Let's get the sniper guy at the back. We've got machine pistol, heavy machine gunner. All right, that guy's got like a box. Charge, let's put a few. Maybe he'll like run at them. We've got mortar. All right, there's a dude back there just with some mortar. If you could hold that properly and not aim it at yourself, that'd be great. We've even got planes. It's a little bit unstable, but it's a plane nonetheless. And it's not being piloted by anyone, which is just amazing. Good on your plane. You don't need no person. You're a strong, independent plane. And then, of course, we have the Mark V, which is, I have no idea what- Is that upside down? It looks upside down. Let's put that at the back. All right, I've got headbutters. I've got the wheelbarrow guys. We've got Vlad's. Few berserkers, some Yarls at the back there as well. This is gonna be a good battle. Let's get involved. Here we go. Go, go. Where are the planes going? The planes literally fell out of the sky. They did nothing. This tank thing, I have no idea what's going on with this tank. That's a weird tank. And what is that? What is this cannon? We're actually winning. We're just destroying them completely. Yeah, everybody died. I wanna know what these guys actually did at the front here. Let's have a look and see if they even charged in. They sorta of did! They do actually do the stabby motion. You can see that. He's swinging his, like, rifle round like it's a sword. Oh, this guy's about to be impaled by Vlad. Vlad the Impaler. Come on, dude. Oh, you just got shot. Yep. Red wins again. How could we ramp up blue to make this a little bit more fair? Cavalry. Of course. And then some Shogun. <laughs> Go horse! Charge in! Oh, the horse is already dead! What? That was crazy, dude! Okay, the Shogun are getting in there. They are getting right in there and going down the stream. <laughs> Come on, Shogun! Race in! Oh, they died. That one's in there! He's also been shot. Come on, Vlad! You can do it, champ! You can do it! Charge in! Start stabbing him! Now, now the Yarl's being shot. Wow. This team is just way too powerful. I'm bringing in the big guns. 
We've got some ice giants now. Come on. An ice giant versus a World War I tank. All of you guys wanted to see that happen. Well, now it is. It's like this fictional mythical being thing coming in to destroy an actual World War I tank. Come on, dudes. Yeah, it's like no match. See, the ice giants are just going to punch the tank off the map. That's what I'm hoping for. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No! The ice giant's dead! Oh, that sucks. There goes the tank! Victory for the blue, finally. So what do these planes actually do? Like, whoa, that's a lot of planes. So if we put a few planes in, do they do much? Let's put them up against just some mortars, just to see if anything happens. Oh, they're kind of... What, what? They went backwards and then fell out of the sky. What if we put a lot of them in? Up against a lot of these dudes. Alright, go planes. Alright, they, they just exploded. I don't know why they're exploding. I guess it's the gun that they're being shot with? Come on, come on. They're swooping in! I don't know what's up with these planes. I don't know why they're flying in like that. World War II, let's go ancient sandbox. This way you know we mean business. All right, US Ranger, S-M-L-E, stands for smile. That's what it means. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's got like a weird inside outside thing going on with his vest. Good on you champ, you gave it your best. Let's create like some kind of full on, like, you know, army sort of formation. U.S. Ranger Bazooka. What? These are guys with bazookas. I thought a bazooka was a rocket launcher. Are they not the same thing? They look the same. Look at this guy. This guy looks like he should go back to class. Oh my god, there's flamethrowers. Yes. Then, of course, we have some jeeps. <laughs> just, just some jeeps. I don't know why. They have, like, guns on the back and everything. I mean, guns on the front and the sides. Let's get a few jeeps. We have Sherman, the Shermanator, and something that looks like a bus. What is that? Oh, it's a wall. It's a Russian artillery. Okay. All right, we've got this dynasty army here. It's quite large. You can see the gist of it. Yes, we have ninjas. Of course we have ninjas. Let's see how they go. Everything is slowed down a bit. But look at those, like, flamethrowers coming in. Burning them! Oh my god. Oh my god. It's absolute destruction. The jeeps are in there. The jeeps have just rolled right over them. It's already a blue victory. What? How did they win so quickly? Let's see this in slow-mo. Let's see what happens. So I think the tanks have like fired stuff. Right, we've got some bullets flying through the air. <laughs> they look like actual bullets. Just going through. Uh, we've got the jeeps coming through. Oh, right. Those tanks have massive explosive rounds that just destroy everything. This time, we have senseis. Let's actually see how this goes, though. So I'm going to slow-mo it. Right. Oh, my God. Half of my senseis are dead already. It's just carnage! I can't beat them! I can't get, like, any damage in there! <laughs> what? How? How am I gonna win this one? I know. Cavalry. Go, cavalry! Alright. Slow-mo on it. Slow-mo on it. Run in, dudes! Here we go. They're gonna charge in. Oh, nice. Nice! Yes! We're actually taking some of them out this time. This is good. Come on, charge through, start attacking things. All right, the, half the soldiers are still alive. There's horses everywhere. It's scary. <laughs> oh man, Peter is gonna be after me. I've killed so many horses. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. This is the stuff. All right, so a lot of the uh, a lot of the soldiers are dead. Okay, now it's basically just the tanks left. And the jeeps. The jeeps have gone sentient. And they're running everyone over. Blue still won. This is happening. This is totally happening. Actually, I'm going to put them right on the front line like this. 
just loads of ice giants. The bodies of the ice giants will protect the ones but like behind them, right? Look at this! Yeah! It's like a wall of ice giants. It's an ice wall like in Game of Thrones. Wow. Wow. The destruction. Okay. They're actually, they've wiped out the army already. Now they're getting in there and they're punching. They're punching themselves. They're punching each other in the face. Why? Punch that jeep. Someone punch that jeep. Come on. Yep. Yep. That's it. That's good. All right. Now keep punching the, uh, the tanks. Oh no. No, you just killed a stack of my ice giants. You can't beat World War II! You can't do it! Even with all these ice giants, that jeep is still alive. If I bought... See, I don't want to buy a jeep now, because if I feel like... If I bought a jeep, right, and then I went up against an ice giant, the ice giant would probably win. Come on, punch it. Punch it. Oh, look at that! They're getting destroyed by the tanks! Even though there's that jeep there. The jeep was a distraction the whole time. Stop punching your dead friend. Stop it. They're so mad, they're fighting each other. Come on, dudes. Nah, they died. All of them died. Whoa, look at this! So this is Monkey Kings. <laughs> look at that! They've lifted the jeep off, off the ground! That's amazing! It's like a tornado of Monkey Kings. That guy has two pupils per eyeball. Why? <laughs> All right, look at that. That is so cool to see. Keep going, guys. I feel like we can win this one. Come on, monkey kings to the rescue. They just need to destroy these sheeps. Jeeps? They're jeeps, they're not sheeps. And then we'll be fine. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. keep hitting them. See, I thought the monkey kings would be able to, like, distract all the other, like, enemies and stuff. There's a monkey king. Looked like he was driving that jeep for a minute. Why are these jeeps so tough? Yeah! I think that jeep is now dead. Okay, good. Kill this jeep. Oh, no. My monkey kings are dying. Okay, yeah! They're going for it! Oh, no, they died. The only way I'm going to be able to beat this army is with another actual army. Who would win out of World War I and World War II? This is what everyone wants to know. So there's 56 units on that side. I'm going to get some mortar. Right, let's get a few of them. Get them up in the hills. I don't even know what they do. I think they fire something explosive. We've got recon planes that fall out of the sky. I'm gonna get them there anyway. I don't even care if they fall out of the sky. I'm putting them there for show, just to intimidate them. Let's get some anti-tank guns, some artillery. Let's put them there as well. I don't know gun words, I'm trying my best. Then we've got some Mark V, Mark V5s which look like they're upside down, but apparently they're not. I've given, like, World War I some more dudes just because the planes are going to fall out of the sky anyway, and I don't know if they're as tough as the World War II guys. They don't have flamethrowers like jeeps and tanks and stuff. Well, they've got those, but they look like they're upside down. <laughs> so I gave them a chance. All right, go. Oh, God. Oh, my God. My computer hates this one. It hates it. I can't even see what's going on. Better slow it down. All right. Let's find out. Let's find out. Go, dudes. Go. What's happening? All right, we've got a jeep on the ground. Yet again, the jeeps are proving to be like this crazy distraction. This is a really cool mod. I like this one. So this mod's actually made by like a few modders. It's like a collaboration almost, I guess, with uh, a few modders going in on it. Oh, dude, there's like one of my planes is still alive. It's up there. It's flying around. It's going to swoop down and I don't know. What are you doing? Don't crash! Come on, plane! Swoop one of those guys! That's it, that's the stuff! That's the stuff! Oh, they actually fire as well! That's pretty good. I'm glad that the, the planes actually have guns, and they're somewhat useful. Oh, the plane, I think, wants to fight the jeep, but it's a little bit hesitant! Come on, dude! Get in there! Fight that jeep! Fight him! It's a plane versus a jeep! It's, no one would ever expected this battle, not even on, like, you know, the Discovery Channel would you see this stuff. Come on, dude. <laughs> Come on. No! The plane has bailed. No, it's back! No, it's definitely dead now. On this episode of When Jeeps Attack, <laughs> we have two soldiers who have been pinned down with this, like, crazy wild jeep. Oh, the jeep has, like, jumped into the ocean. See ya, jeep, you idiot. What was that? There's a mortar guy 
fire on his own men. It's fair to say that Blue has won yet again. Like One Punch Man would really help me out right now. What about just like loads of these Gatling guns? Would that even do anything? Would that like destroy him? There we go, that, that's 144 of them. Wow. Okay, so that actually did a fair bit of damage. These Gatling guns still look like they're working. Half of them just disappeared. And the Jeeps have just gone wild again. <laughs> That's the face of pure evil right there. These things are the worst. I'm going to be having nightmares about these Jeeps. Okay, okay. All right. I can, I can handle this. I can handle this. This is it. This is World War II versus 200 Kings. Whew. Come on, Kings. You can do it. Kings are tough. Everybody knows how tough the Kings are. They have loads of HP and they do quite a bit of damage with that sword. The only problem is they're probably going to get distracted by the Jeeps again, right? Oh, there's one Jeep dead. One Jeep dead. Two Jeeps dead. Come on. It's almost three Jeeps dead. Just got to whack that other Jeep. Whack it. Yes. It's another Jeep down. We've just got one more Jeep to take care of, and then that's it. That's it. That's all Jeeps gone. Now we just need to go and take out the other artillery, and we're fine. What are they going at? What are you dudes hitting? Move. Move away. No, the kings got destroyed. I can't beat this army. I cannot beat an army that I've created. If you guys have any ideas on how to beat this army with the regular units, let me know in the comments. Give us one of these ones, and I'll see you guys next time.